Comedian and actor Tom Clark has traveled coast to coast doing stand-up and has even performed internationally. Well, he is a Zany's favorite, and he is back in Rosemont with shows tonight through Saturday. And Tom joins us now with all the details. Welcome home of sorts. You're just from up the road in uh, Milwaukee there. I am. I yeah, am. so you like coming down here and hanging out with us down in Chi-Town? And... I do, you guys. Not not such a big fan of me. Yeah, uh, I was going to say, watch this, watch this. Hey, congrats to the Packers. <laughs> I know. She loves, she's a huge Bears fan, too. Yeah, it was, it was a good game. It At least it's not Aaron Rodgers, it's Jordan Love. Jordan Love's a nice guy. <laughs> you know. Can we find a new subject? <laughs> okay, we'll move on. Thank you. Yeah. You guys won the Super Bowl in 85. Right, we got that. Yeah. All right. Okay. Um, yeah, let's move on. Yes, move on. Okay, um, so you and your wife, this I find very interesting. There are not a lot of couple comedians. Mm -hmm. uh, so who's darker, you or your wife? <laughs> My wife is definitely the edgy one in the family. Okay. Yeah, she's the one I have to, like, we, we, we tone it down for this church gig. Oh, yeah. wow. <laughs> <laughs> we can't say certain things. So you guys work together a lot? Yeah, we do a lot of shows. We, we travel around. We, we were talking about our French bulldog, so we never left our dog alone. Okay. So she literally travels with us to gigs. Hilarious. And uh, we travel to wineries and breweries, so I, I, I do everything. I'll do a swap meet. It doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. right, this says a lot about somebody. What's your dog's name? Ruby, Ruby. Ruby. Oh, okay. Ooh, so that's a pretty normal. With a bulldog, it's either uh, it's either a uh, an old person name or a stripper name. Oh, okay. It's, so it's either like Beatrice My, or Bubbles. Old person name. Yeah. Frankie. What is it? Frankie. Frankie. Yeah. yeah it's yeah, an totally old guy. Cool. Old guy name. The old yeah. guy name. Totally. Yeah. <laughs> I like Ruby. I think that's a that's cool really cute name. That's a good one. Yeah. Um, so how is it different um, living in LA now? Because that's where you are. So you're actually doing a little bit of, of comedy and acting. Is yeah, that because yeah. of by by way of being in LA, that's just something that's, you do. That was, that was why I moved out there was oh. to to do more of the acting stuff, and uh, I actually picked up a dramatic role. I played a uh, murderer on The Closer. Yes. I love The with Closer. Kira yes. 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 With Kira Sedgwick. Yeah. yeah, I was like, "There's no way I'm going to get this role," and and then I got the booking, and I was like, "This is so well, weird. it can be a little dark, and comedians can be a little that's dark, true. you know." And you play a quirky guy too. Yeah, quirky, quirky creepy. Yeah, well, it's one of the same. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's a nice way of putting it. Yeah. Which one do you like better? Do you like stand-up better than acting? Because I imagine stand-up's probably harder. Uh, I mean, I, I love both. I mean, obviously acting acting is nice with the residuals and you're not working mm -hmm. and you get the money after mm -hmm. the fact and, and you don't have to travel anywhere. But, I mean, I, I love both. I mean, I, if I, can, I just, I love splitting the difference between the two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And coming here is my favorite. Well, the comedy is taking you kind of international because you went to South Africa and yeah. uh, you were in uh, Montreal as well. Right. I did the New Faces in Montreal. I did uh, Cape Town, South Africa. I, I actually... Very rare, like all the people I get booked on this are like international, like Jim Jeffries and Burt Kreischer. And then I emailed the website and I said, hey, do you need, a, I'd like to perform for you guys. And they said, okay. And uh, I sent them a link and they, they booked me. And it was oh, like cool. such a like Cinderella story. So I was in South Africa for four weeks performing at this theater every night for three for uh, three weeks I performed at this theater so cool. and did like 15 minutes it was like a dream I, yeah. I, I've always wondered how does the comedy translate I mean yeah you know we have some you know like Midwest you, we get it yeah okay <laughs> but then you start going branching out and then you go internationally how does that Cape translate? Town is like the Milwaukee Oh of really? Africa? No, oh. it isn't. Um, <laughs> I was like, really? Oh, okay. No, but it's uh, it, it, it translates pretty well. They're they're first of all they're excited about it because I think I feel like South Africa is sort of new to the comedy scene, so they're just excited at some guys up there telling jokes. Um, but uh, but no, I loved it. You just change some words and call it a lift instead of an elevator. You're standing in queue instead of lines. It, it's oh. like just slight little variations. Uh, I like it. I watched your new special, which was from a clip from here, oh, yeah. uh, and you filmed this in L.A. And you kind of make fun of L.A. even though you live there now. That's right. I said, uh, I'm glad to be out of Milwaukee because people in Milwaukee are so fake. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> people in Milwaukee are like, oh, no, the factory closed down. How am I going to feed my family? Yeah, oh, take it easy. Yeah. 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 Is so, it a hard transition from now living in L.A., from being a Midwestern kid? I mean, now I'm so spoiled. I, I kind of came here yesterday, and it was zero degrees, yeah. and I'm like, this isn't, uh, this isn't right. This yeah. isn't for humans. Yeah. yeah. I had a paper route in Milwaukee, and I used to deliver the, and for, 
it was insane. I mean, I'd be in 30 below weather, mm -hmm. and icicles coming off yes. my eyelids, and uh, I, I, I was like, how did I do this? Like, so, so quickly, that thin skin, yep. just, you know, develops when you move out to those warmer climates. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm, yeah I'm, I'm the worst. I, I can't <laughs> handle it. I'm wearing, I'm wearing like a thermal shirt. Yeah, you got like here. three layers on, <laughs> and it's 35 <laughs> degrees out today. Oh, well, we'll get used to it real quick. Yeah. Uh, Tom, thanks, thanks so Tom. much for joining us. Uh, shows tonight um, and through the weekend out in Rosemont. That's right. Um, so check them out. There are tickets available, we do believe. Um, if not, I'm quite sure they're going to be sold out as soon as you uh, walk oh. off the stage. Yeah. All right.